Hey guys, um, I'm gonna make an update. Um, I'm using a different camera. Well, it's an actual iPad, but it seems to be working better. Um, so yeah, I usually record with my iPod, but they both died, so I'm gonna use my iPad or oh, my family iPad. So yeah, so basically, this update is gonna be on the fish tanks that I have and what I got new and what's gonna happen in the future. So yeah, so. Um, this what you're looking at is a ten gallon tank. It has thread, three radiated sliders, one male, two females. It has two filters. Um, it has basking area. Uh, as you can see, it has a little ramp going up into that under, right under the light bulb. So that's where they bask. Um, they're doing good. Um, it's temporary set up for them. They're usually outside. We usually take them outside for a bit. Um, their foods are on the side. They just eat shrimp, red shrimp. They eat red shrimp and the reptilmen floating food sticks. And that's pretty much it. Um, very easy to care for. Did a water change uh, a couple of days ago or so on the 10 gallon tank, which I have here. This setup will cost you like 30 bucks around there. Tank itself, 10 bucks. Filters like 10, 20 bucks. If you have a, a heat lamp around, that's what I use. So yeah, basking area, not that, not not that much. Uh, so pretty much it. So I'm gonna walk you to my room where I got my fish tanks. Um, so yeah, so we're walking as we're walking to the fish tanks. Um, sorry about the water quality on my 40 gallon tall tank. It's a little jacked up right now because I added the gravel not that long ago, so it's pretty jacked up. We just turn on the light. So it's like, wow, why is the water so cloudy? Like I said, it's the gravel. Um, I'm working on it. Like I said, doing water changes. Trying to keep the gravel clean and everything, but it's just not working. I um, don't want to use chemicals. I just want to go with the, the right thing to do is just do water changes. I heard it takes about a month for it to go away or so. So, yeah. So, as you see right now, I got my Oscar. Uh, he's a big boy. Uh, are you getting big? I bought him when he was about two and a half inches. Um, it cost me like 10 bucks. Um, he's pretty big. Um, I had a couple, I had an offer at a pet shop. The guy told me he'd give me twenty bucks for him, but I told him no. He said because he wants them already big. I told him nah. Um, I like to watch him grow. So like I can say he's he's um he's about five and a half inches, reaching six inches. He's healthy, happy. Uh, he likes swimming. I mean, he has a forty gallon tank to himself. Usually people put them in the 15 gallon, like what I have them start off in, and that's what I have an Oscar too. I'm gonna show them. So this is Chewy. It's beautiful side view. He has, he has like really nice markings. Really chubby and healthy. Eats good. Swims good. He exercises. Swims a lot. Have him exercise. Tap on the glass like that around the whole the whole tank, and he just follows me. Let's see if he does that right now. It's a little shy because of the camera, but yeah. So um, his tank, it's a nice setup for him. He has a power head, um, not the most expensive. It's just an Aquatech, nothing fancy. Um, has a just a clamp, a lamp that clamps. Um, he has a top fin 75 filter, um, and then he has a glass canopy. Like I said, it's not the most expensive setup, but it works looks nice just that it's a uh, cloudy which should start going away I'm gonna be getting a 10 inch or 11 inch pleco in this tank see how my Oscar does with them hopefully he doesn't do anything bad to him because if he does who knows what will happen <laughs> just saying <laughs> um, but yeah so that's his tank setup um, the reason I'm going to get the Pleco was I wasn't satisfied with what I got. Okay, I have the receipts still somewhere. 
So I have bought a divider for my tank, and it's just like way too short. I, um, the the lady that I bought it from thought it was gonna fit perfect, but I I didn't think it was, and it didn't. So I'm gonna go return this. It almost cost thirty bucks, so I didn't think it was worth it either. Um, as I opened it, just didn't like it. So I'm gonna return that later on today when I can. My parents have a chance to take me to go return that. Just gonna get a Pleco for this tank. Like I said, he's getting pretty big. He doesn't like the camera. But yeah, he got pretty big really fast. So I'm gonna show you my other tank. So over here you're looking at my 15 gallon tank. Um, in this 15 gallon tank, I have another baby Oscar. No, um, I no, I seen you in my other, I I shown you in my other videos. Um, so he's he's a little healthy guy. Uh, he has orange. He's a tiger Oscar. I think he's a wild type tiger Oscar. He's really beautiful. I have a yellow electric cichlid in this. In that breeder, he was too small. He would have fit in the Oscar's mouth. I think he would have got eaten by now. Doesn't seem like the Oscar does anything to him now that he's in the net. Um, like I said, I tried to put the yellow electric cichlid inside with the five and a half, but he did not do good in that tank. He kept fighting with my guppies. Well, not fighting, but he was trying to hurt them and stuff, so I didn't think that was a good idea. Then I got my six to seven inch Pleco in here. It's a big guy. Um, I just put him in with the Oscar yesterday, and the Oscar did not seem to do anything towards him. Uh, kind of just ignores him. Uh, just helping me clean the tank up. Um, water's crystal clear. Uh, he cleaned the heater for me a bit. The rocks are a little not, not that bad looking, but they do have waste. The Pleco, he's just chilling, cleaning up the rocks, stuff. So that's my Oscar, my newest Oscar. Um, he's in the 15 gallon for now. He's a grow out tank for him. Uh, like I said, I used to have an 11 Oscar, and he passed away. Um, this Oscar over here killed him. I'm not sure why, but he just killed him. So um, I wasn't there when he killed him, but I could tell because he had like messed up fins and stuff. And then. Um, I got this new other Oscar, this new Oscar. Um, he's two and a half inches right now. Uh, I got fattened him up, getting him a little chunky. See his colors better. Pleco is pretty nice. Um, my electric yellow. Sick lady just chilling right there. Um, it's pretty big, I'm not gonna lie, the little thing where he's at. Um, I feel bad for him. Did not expect to have to put him in there, but um, I rescued another Oscar. And you could tell I like Oscars. So I have this black uh, Tiger Oscar, and I have an albino Tiger Oscar. So yeah. Then over here, I got a five and a half gallon tank. Um, it has three guppies, my semi's algae eater, um, and it has two plecos in here, two baby plecos. The one's on the heater, and the other one's on the rocks and the gravel. Pretty small. Sorry, I'm sick, so I'm kind of like out of it. But yeah, so it's just an update. Um, I cleaned the filter little uh, thing where it, the water goes in. Feed my Oscar this. Algae wafers, Hikari algae wafers. And then I got the cichlid sticks, which I feed this little guy. I don't know, he eats them, he loves them. And then I feed him these pellets. I feed both my Oscars with pellets. Um, but I usually feed the, my bigger Oscar these pellets. I don't know, he just loves them. And like I say, it's pretty big. Uh, he's pretty active for an Oscar. At first, first couple weeks he wasn't. He was kind of shy. 
plus I had them in different tanks because I moved. Started off in the five and a half, no, first he went to the fifteen. Then I then I disconnected it, brought it to this house, set it up here. And he wasn't he was in this tank for a while with his other friend. Then I moved it back into here. He killed that Oscar. No, the lemon Oscar that I had, he killed him. So then I moved him back into and then I set up this tank and finally he's established and he's gonna be in here for a good amount of time. I actually have to buy a bigger net for him just himself. And good thing because I got that big pleco so it comes in handy. So it's a bigger net. He got it quite big. Um, he looks way small. I mean, he looks way bigger than my little baby Oscar. Um, so it's a temporary tank for my Oscar. Um, Pleco's gonna stay in here. I'm gonna get a bigger Pleco for that tank. Uh, I'm still planning on getting more tanks, but um, I'm gonna chill on that for a bit. Um, I think I'm fine with what I have right now. Keep a side look. He's really, he's really nice. I haven't done any hand feeding with him yet. He has nice big fins. And if you could please tell me if he's a male or female, like I, I'm pretty sure he's a male. Um, but if you could tell me, um, please don't be shy to comment um, down there below. But yeah, so he's pretty big. Uh, he likes to set up uh, the power here is Really nice, working nice. So that's his tank setup. Uh, that's my 15 gallon tank setup. And uh, my five and a half, which should be lighted. So five and a half, 15, 40. So, yeah, so that's it for this video. So just please comment, rate, and subscribe.